We all know that you can never have enough USB ports on your desktop computer. Unplugging one device just to plug in another device can be annoying and inconvenient. So here's a product from Inatech that will give you two USB 3 ports for the front panel of your desktop computer. This is a review of that product and I will also be showing you how to install it. Most newer system boards will have the, the header to plug in this product but you can check easily enough um, via your um, user guide that came with your computer or your, your uh, systems board. So let's review the product and I'll also show you how to install it. The product retails uh, on Amazon for $17 and it's £10 sterling in Amazon UK and it's available on most of the Amazon stores. So let's show you the Inatech USB front panel device. So the Inatech USB 3 front panel 2 port and the model number is FP2001 and the 550 millimeters is the actual length of this cable which is sufficient to go from one end of your desktop to the other. So you get with this product is two USB 3 ports. The length of the cable is 500 as I said. You need in your desktop computer a 20 pin USB 3.0 connection. I will show you that in a minute. And you also get four screws for connecting the device in your computer. Let's show you the features on it here. So features the USB front panel to be installed into a free 3.5 inch bay of desktop. Compliant with USB 3 super speed 5G uh, bits per second and high speed. It's also compliant with um, um, USB 2. So that makes it backward compatible. And it's also backward compatible to USB 1.1. And it expands your system basically by two USB 3 ports via one USB 3 20 pin adapter from your motherboard. So you have to have that 20 pin adapter in order to install this product. And specifications product dimensions are 102 by 95 by 25 millimeters. And its weight is 20, uh, 90 grams. And the operating system that you require is Windows XP Vista 7, 8 or 8.1. And it'll also run on Mac operating systems. So now we'll open the box and see what's in it. So there's the product itself. So that's the product there, that's the cable, uh, it is the length, it'll go the whole way um, through your case. So it's very long, 550 millimeters, and that's what it looks like from the front, two lovely USB 3 ports for the front of your desktop. And you can see there's two screws on two uh, nuts that you'd connect your screws to on either side of the product. Okay. Now, I've been uh, using this product um, for, for a while now. And uh, it does exactly what it says. Um, it's USB 3. I have USB 3 um, connections to it. Um, flash drives and, and they're working at, at, at the high end speeds. And the arc is back, backward compatible to USB 2 and USB 1. So you also get in the box your four screws. And you get returns exchange and guarantee 
and you'd go to the website to get your um, th that kind of uh, if you had a problem with it you'd have to go through the website to get it sorted okay and if you buy it on Amazon um, you can go through the, those um, websites also okay now we shall install the USB 3 2 port for the front of your desktop of course you will need a screwdriver a Phillips head screwdriver so you will be arted then okay um, but basically all you have to do really is touch one of the screws on the power supply and that will ground you as long as it's plugged in to the wall socket and that will mean that it will be earthed and make sure that the power supply is turned off um, just, just to ground yourself to zero okay 20 pin port and it will usually be, usually be located somewhere around the front panel connectors um, you'll see it it will be um, blue colour um, I will put a picture up on this screen now to show you what that looks like so you may already have USB 2 ports in your your on your computer already and they would be somewhere along here possibly down here or at the top so they'll be blue in color if they're USB 3 so you can see there that they're clearly are blue and this this product there are the screws for it just put them there for a second so we have um, an option here because um, the, the, the case will have the option of putting um, in a, f a floppy disk but to, most people don't use them anymore so it's perfect for this product so all you do is if you have the USB capability on your board then and you want two more extra ports in the front of two more USB ports USB 3 ports on the front of your case is you'd install it the easiest way to do it is to to um, place it from the front of the panel take off the panel that's here and place it in like so and that will fit into the USB 3 the, the flappy area and then just line it up at the front so that it, so that it looks um, fairly right okay and then put your screws in on the put the screw in here and the screw in on the far side so you'll have to take off both panels of your your uh, desktop computer both side panels and then you just plug this guy in to the USB 3 you plug this guy in to the USB 3 port on your systems board now the reason why we install it from the front of the case is so that we don't have to be removing cables to put it in from this side so it's the easiest way to do it is to place it from the front of the case so you feed the cable in you push this guy in and, and match it up with the front of the case and then you place the screw to hold it in place now this particular case you can only put in one screw on each side but that is plenty to actually and before you tighten it just get it fairly flush here at the front and then just tighten the screw and that's it installed that's it installed in the case and then if you have the port on your systems board you would plug this guy into it it's keyed so it will only fit in one way now the connector on the motherboard is going to be um, a green color I'll show it to you here so you just plug it into this one so just consult your um, manual and you'll find out which one it is it's usually blue but sometimes it's some other color so that's it you have now installed a USB front panel thanks for watching